mechanisms in this bill that I'm not for sure that the legislature fully understands. That bill has everything to do with all the reasons you can't be pulled over. Now law enforcement in Central Illinois are pushing back against a bill that would drastically cut down the number of infractions they can pull people over for. Good evening, I'm Brandon Morano. And I'm Karina Rubio. The bill's sponsor says this is just about starting a conversation, but members of law enforcement are still concerned. Our Capitol Bureau Chief Cole Hankey is live in our Capitol Newsroom. So Cole, what exactly are they worried about with this bill? Well, this bill is actually a continuation from a push we saw last year in the Capitol to cut down on the number of traffic stops and potentially the racial profiling that lawmakers say can come with it. The bill had hardly been filed for a day, but DeWitt County Sheriff Mike Walker shared it on the Sheriff's Department's social media accounts. Fortunately, when these things come out, I want the, I want the people of my county, the people who vote for me and expect me to keep them safe, to know that I do not support this. The bill would heavily cut back on what police could pull drivers over for. If passed, this bill would not allow police to pull people over for expired registration stickers, broken headlights or taillights, failure to wear a seatbelt, certain speeding violations, and broken mirrors or excessive tints on windows. Other county sheriffs also expressed concern about the bill because of how it can affect police's ability to intervene before fatal accidents. There are certain vehicle code um, things that are contributors to accidents, are contributors to reckless behavior, speeding, improper lane usage are two of those things. The bill's sponsor, Representative Justin Slaughter, says the bill was meant to start a conversation to see if the state could reduce the number of offenses you can be pulled over for. The lawmakers behind these kinds of pushes are concerned these traffic stops are being used as a reason to stop and search cars for other evidence of more serious crimes. In a statement, Slaughter said, quote, For decades, Illinois has wrestled with the challenge of racial bias in traffic stops and the disparate outcomes that are too often the result. At no point in this effort has anyone's goal been to take away the tools police need to keep communities safe. The bill would also make any additional evidence of other crimes that was found during a traffic stop for one of these minor offenses inadmissible in court. Oh, to me, it's kind of personal against the profession in a way as well, because there are other avenues. Now, again, this bill was just filed yesterday, which means it has a long way to go, including multiple votes before it would actually become law. And so far, there is not any sort of vote scheduled for this bill as well. Reporting in Springfield, I'm Cole Hankey, WCIA3, your local news leader.